All right. It's like 80 degrees in my room, and but I'm still itching to get going. Maybe staring at this frosty tundra of Wonderland will make me feel more cool. I don't think it works that way. I could hope. Now, I think I actually remember where we're supposed to be going next. Which is crazy, I know. But I believe it was the Asado Desert was where we need to go next. We don't have too many also, places. yes, that desert thing is the next. Okay. Right. That's what I thought. I was looking at the map. Uh, I think yesterday, I think. So it's like trying to path out uh, where we need to go next. But, uh... Oh. Okay. That's weird. I don't know why I'm only just now finding that out, but that's weird. Moving on. You know, if I'm gonna uh, rant about anything... Uh, my goodness, do I not like this map. This has yeah. got to be one of the worst maps that I have ever experienced in a Pokemon game. Absolutely terrible. You get yeah, disoriented really way too easily. Yeah, they shouldn't, they shouldn't rotate the main map. Uh-huh. I probably don't have this one done. Do I? Nope. Still only got two. There must be only a handful of trainers over here. Actually, I just realized I'm going the wrong way. This is fine. All right. In the desert we go. Oh, so this is where you normally get the rollers. Gotcha. Whoa. Oh. Oh, I didn't expect to see that so soon. What you mean? You didn't expect a di giant dinosaur in a Pokemon game? <laughs> Hi. You're huge. Well, I think. Oh, you mean the Pokemon, right? Hello? Do I interact with you? Are you sure you want to find that out? <laughs> Professor Sada, hi! I was expecting something from Marvin, but I guess not. Hello, Kit. This is Professor Sada. Great Tusk is a Pokemon that came from the great crater of Paldea. I ask you do whatever is needed to subdue it for me, with all caution, of course. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> but yes, this is called Great Tusk. What on earth would I use on this, so? Oh, no. Yup, you wanted to ask. <laughs> Oh! Oh, that works really well, but also... Kill it with fire. I need to outlive it. I need to outlive it. No, 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 Oh my goodness, the ruffle it. Just a little... At this point, even if you go down, the thing's almost dead. Oh, it's gonna do this thing. Yes, it's it. gonna do this bullcrap. I hate it when they do that. All right, you giant pachyderm. I'm not through with you. Well, that's a bit rude. It is a pachyderm. I'm not wrong. <laughs> Two. 
looks like you found yourself a titan. Wait. That's the quaking earth titan? Uh... It, it, is that thing even a Pokemon? It must be trying to get pumped up with that uh, little snack. Time to show that thing what you and me can do. Uh, speaking of quaking earth titan, uh, I'll be right back. Uh oh. Well, you know what, Palafin, come in here. You have literally done nothing since I boxed you. Thank you for going after school villain. Skull villain, what are you doing? Okay, do not use the other one. Oh, this does not work as well as I had hoped. But that's okay. Okay, yeah, this was a better choice. Just jump punch our way to victory, I guess. Ah. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Good job, Pelfin. You actually proved useful now. <laughs> now that I can actually get you to obey. Ah. Uh. Yes! Nice going, little buddy. What even was that thing, though? I kind of feel like maybe I've seen it before somewhere. Ah, well, it doesn't matter. It's dead now. Anyway, I bet we head inside here. We'll find more of that Urban Mystica it was eating. Let's get to play some once over before that thing decides to come back. And hopefully Chigger won't be gone long. <laughs> come out, come out wherever you are. Why are you telling that to a plant? It's not like it's gonna move, Arvin. Just saying. Ooh, shiny. Yes, found it. Here's our little herb. Sour it. Oh, ooh. Oh. This shape, the sheen, it looks like it'll taste horrible, which means it's gotta be good for you. Ah, uh, not necessarily, man. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? Okay, Sour Urban Miska is chock full of nutrients. It's great for boosting your overall health. It says here it works wonders whether you're tired physically or mentally. Perks you right up. No time to waste. Let's get some food going. Sorry for the wait. Here's a super healthy sandwich that will perk you right up once you eat it. Plus, as a token of our friendship, here's another Titan badge. He's upon it, and oh, as you eat. Nice. Sandwich defeated. <laughs> yep. Man, here I thought my stomach was done, but nope. Oh, no. You miss Palafin actually, you know, pull its weight for once and actually listening. Blech. I mean, to be fair, 
It was only now, just after the last badge that we got oh, that... Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. You don't deserve a sandwich. Why? He's been helping us get around really easily. Doesn't our good boy deserve a sandwich? No. Seriously, how can you say no to that face? Easy. No. That's a bad karate on. Smack him, smack him on the nose. <laughs> what did you just hit? It sounded like you hit something. I said that's a bad karate on. You smack him on the nose. Oh, I thought I heard you actually hit something. For that was me putting my, that was me putting my water down. If you did. Oh, okay. Sorry. I can't resist. He's he's so he's got such a cute face. There's a reason he's why just, he's just completely given up. <laughs> he's like, no, nope. I'm just gonna assume you're gonna give your sandwich to your ride. Ho ho ho! Would you look at that? Seems like someone's got a proper appetite now. This is kind of weird because we actually have our own Mabossif on our party now. Congratulations, is now turned into the Breath of the Wild. Oh! Still doesn't look like it's anywhere close to returning to its battle form. Oh, don't feel bad. You're doing your best, buddy. No, he's not. He's just leeching sandwiches. Seems healthy enough physically. He just got some kind of mental block that's preventing it from returning to his true form. A, a, a mental block? I've read about it in books before. A mental scar, like. Psychological trauma, you know. I think that's what you. Are you saying know, our is... ride has PTSD? I mean, if uh, if it if you recall how he was treating at the beginning, I'd have PTSD if I had to put up with his shit all day and night. Uh, maybe. Of course, if I were, of course, if I was one of those things, I'd just like bite his head off. But that's just me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he probably could too. Maybe had a terrifying experience of battle, so now it's scared to battle at all? Well, don't worry, I'm sure both that brute and my boss tip will make a full recovery again eventually. I didn't think we were getting glide because I, I, I know for a fact there were two abilities we were missing for Koridon. One was gliding is an and another is climbing. I thought we got the gliding from the last Titan, not this one. So that is seriously throwing me off for a loop. Nah, you gotta get more stamina before you can climb like Link. <laughs> so how do you feel, my boss Tiff? How's that Urba Mystica working? Ugh, uh, of pressure. Borf. Borf. Nah, like it's fair to expect any kind of Urba Mystica to have some huge effect, right? I mean, it's making our Crydon do crazy things, so... And it's not like the effect has to be a me, either. Uh, it's pretty effective on <laughs> the other thing, but uh, maybe he's just getting high off the celery or something. Or the poppy seeds. Hey, it's okay, don't worry. It doesn't look like poppy seeds, so... K Kit and I are gonna make sure your rays rain. We got one more herb to go, and I bet it's the best of them all. It's... it's gotta be. Alright, Kit. Next stop on our little herb hunt should be the last. But we can't lose Steve until we're done. Let's keep up our momentum. Here we go! He's like doing jumping jacks! Ta -ta -ta. 
Hello, Kit. This is Sada. I detect that Karina has regained one more of its original power. After it has jumped into the air, you should try pressing the button again. It should glide now. Oh. Man, this is probably why they didn't give the uh, man character a Pikachu in the animes, because, like, how do you ride a Pikachu around? <laughs> That's kind of creepy. <laughs> 